Kyler, what, uh, what kind of effort does it take when you're in the middle of a streak like this to, you know, continue to be upbeat and continue to be positive? Because as guys have said over the last few days, like moping around isn't going to get you anywhere either. But is it a bit of an effort to try and maintain that? I for sure think so. I mean, it takes a full 60 minutes. Um, you know, it takes everybody. You can't just take one or two guys, um, you know, to play a full game. Um, you know, it's got to come from within the group, and it's got to be the full group. So I think that's, I think that's what we got to do, and um, I think we got to start believing in, in each other just a little bit more. People, uh, you know, people might assume that it's negative and down and tough in the room right now. How would you describe what it's like in that locker room right now while you guys are going through this? You know, I still think, um, you know, we're very upbeat, um, even throughout games. Um, yeah, I think once we, we've been going down a goal, um, you know, it's been tough to, you know, work from behind, but, you know, the guys are still in it. Um, you know, just things aren't going our way right now. And, and how about for you personally, Kyler? What sorts of things are you working on and, and are you focused on just to try and maybe give yourself that little extra push that helps the team get out of this? Yeah. Um, obviously, I've been, you know, this year I've been talking about my shots. Um, yeah, I haven't got, been getting too many of them, um, you know, but trying to work, help the team win, um, you know, whether that's keeping plays live, um, you know, playing good defense, you know, kind of stuff like that. Hey, Kyler, how's it going? So when you have this bit of a slump here for the team with just nine goals in the last six games, it's easy to say, well, just shoot more, shoot more, but some games you guys have got a, a lot of shots on goal. So, um, you know, what's what's still kind of the, maybe that missing ingredient for jamming a few in? You know, it's tough to say. Um, you know, obviously, getting shots is a big thing. Um, yeah, I think on top of that, we just got to find a way to get our second chances. Um, you know, I feel like second chances are a big thing in the game, and being able to get those, um, you know, I definitely think that will help our team out. Just also, uh, given the time of year, if you don't mind, uh, flashing back to your World Junior, experience this would have been ramping up to that uh what do you remember about that whole month eventually leading into the tournament um i know i played uh, played up here for a few games um got sent back and then i ended up making it um just leading up uh it's actually i think it was a tough season for me um you know going into it but um world juniors um you know kind of helped my game out a lot and it was probably one of the best tournaments i've ever played um you know i was fortunate enough to play um in that outdoor game um which was surreal um, i'll never forget that one snow is about two inches thick on the ice playing through that so that was really cool okay thanks so you uh you talked to us before the season started about how much you've been working on your shot and you said to us I got to get more shots and I got to use this shot I'm working on and you have like I think you have less shots today than you would have had after this mini games last year what do you you know where did it go like where did the desire to get more shots where did it go and can it come back uh it's still there um you know it's a good league um you know everyone out there is in the NHL for a reason, um, you know, they play tight, um, you know, in the D zone. So it's, it's been tough to get to those areas, um, you know, still working on it. Um, you know, but I feel like I'm helping the team out in other ways, um, you know, whether it's keeping plays live, um, you know, second efforts, kind of stuff like that. You would be sort of the top end of that group of support scorers in Edmonton that, you know, that needs to help mix David and Drysaddle win some games here. Uh, do you feel like, you know, maybe it's, you need some offense. Do you feel like some, some pressure to try to be a leader among that group to try to put some pucks in the net here and get this thing rolling? I definitely try to put that pressure on myself. Um, you know, obviously I want to be out there scoring goals, um, you know, making plays. Um, you know, we're having a tough stretch right now. Um, obviously we need a little bit more from the sport cast, and um, you know, I definitely think we're trying our best to do that right now.